we're working we're working our eyes right so what we're doing here is we're working our vestibular ocular reflex okay so uh it's connected to your cerebellum which essentially controls all motor movement and this is i didn't think of this i'm not that smart this is this is from dr emily fury i attended a, a conference a couple years ago where she spoke on this and uh, ever since then we've been incorporating it into our practices every single day so we've got these white x's on the on the walls you can make it whatever it is that you want to make it. It's, it. It doesn't have to be anything particular as long as our guys have something that they can focus on and maintain, maintain their eye contact. So these guys, they have two spots down here on the wall. They're going to stand eight to 10 feet away, eight to 10 feet away from the wall. And what we're doing here is they're going to get themselves into a relaxed position, right? There, there shouldn't be any tension. And this dot is going to be directly in front of where their face is, okay? Now from here, they're going to turn 30 degrees to their left, and then 30 degrees to the right. That's the full range of motion that they'll be working on. And as they're doing this, they're going to be working with the beat of a metronome, okay? So we start out around 150 beats a minute. Um, that's what the average normal human being should be able to, to, to do successfully. Um, and the goal then is to, to get a little bit quicker and faster as the season goes on. Hopefully by the end of this spring, our guys are around the, the 190 to 200 mark. Um, so. All you need to do is download a, a, a metronome app. Um, you can find one in the app store for free. This is the one, one that I've got. Um, so these guys will go at 100, and we'll do this right now at 165 beats a minute, okay? So you guys don't have to do this right now, but just so that the mic can pick it up. This is the beat in which they will be going to, okay? And so as I'm moving from left to right, I'm gonna be moving that 30 degrees at the beat of the metronome. So it's, the whole time they're going to be locked in on that target. You can blink. If you lose focus, just reset and get back to where you need to be. But again, we're, the, the goal, the more we do this, is to get better at it. Um, and we're, we're warming up our body, right? We're warming up our body to be able to, to make the movements that we're trying to do once we start actually getting the ball in our hand in the air and then on the mount. Okay. So these guys are going to do it. We're not going to do it for a full minute. That's what we typically do it for, two to three sets of a minute uh, pre-practice. These guys will just demonstrate for us here for about 20 to 30 seconds, just so you can get an idea as to, to what it is and what they're doing. Okay. You guys ready to roll? All right. Three, two, one. So you can see Matt's a little bit more on pace there. He's doing a pretty good job with the Geno's a little bit slow right now with his time off the metronome. And I think what you'll notice too with these guys, uh, especially with younger kids, is, is looking at where the path of their head takes them. 